a koutou nga mihi o te atu ki a koutou a nei te tehi mihi mai te hau kainga ki a koutou pai marere. Welcome to this video which is really just a thank you from everybody in the community, the iwi kainga and for those of us who have been involved we want to say thank you for your service, thank you for your efforts as this is a whole of region wide event um, we just want to acknowledge and the contribution by everybody and the relationships that have come out of it. So on behalf of the Ho Kainga Nei, Namahi Atu Ki A Koutou, Pai Marere. And we'll hand it over now to Ian Reid. When the spy kicked off on the 5th of February, it was uh, right from the get-go. It was going to be difficult to contain and, uh, and to pull up. And there was nothing that we could have done on that first day to have stopped that fire. So the composition of the fire, the material it was burning, the weather conditions at the time and how dry it was at the time all led to that fire being one of the most complex fires that Nelson's had in, in the last generation, or New Zealand's had actually. When I first heard about the fire I went straight to our district command centre. I was really concerned about uh, the situation for our community, uh, the risk uh, to them being evacuated and for our staff who are undertaking those duties. My first impressions of the fire were that this was something well beyond uh, any experience that we'd had locally. Uh, we could see from the beginning this was a beast with 35 kilometres of perimeter, threat to life, property and infrastructure in many places. I was um, driving towards Richmond um, coming back from Takaka and I saw the start of the fire and I have to say within a matter of minutes I knew that we had something incredibly serious going on in our region. My first impression of the fire was an incredible experience. Uh, I, that afternoon I saw it start, the smoke grew, the smoke grew and then that evening I realised the impact talking to the rural fire service. This was out of control, seeing the fire along the ridges, thinking our property might be completely destroyed and the impacts on all of the community, it was horrendous. As the group controller, I just want to say a big heartfelt thank you to so many people for your support. To the community, the members of the public who were so patient and, and supportive of us, uh, to the emergency services, the volunteers, our iwi supporters, thank you everybody, we appreciate it so much. I would like to thank all of the iwi who were involved, the iwi chairs, and particularly the iwi liaison officers who gave tremendous support to me, council, emergency services, civil defence, they were tremendous in support. Uh, all the emergency services involved, and I won't list them, they have just done such a tremendous job for our community in fighting the fire. Volunteers, and there were just bucket loads of people who came and helped many different things and the whole community for being so patient and working with us as we resolved the fire. I'd really like to acknowledge uh, the emergency service personnel uh, responding to the fires but particularly the volunteers, uh, the volunteers who supported those emergency service staff, everything from assisting us in going door to door to also uh, the people who made sandwiches and baked cakes and bought food to support us uh, in the extended hours of duty. I just want to say a huge thank you to the Nelson Tasman community, to everybody that came out to support um, our families who were evacuated, to all of those wonderful people at the Suburbs Pavilion who organised and helped, to the businesses around our city. A big thank you to our iwi who were so wonderful in supporting the community and those of us working in the Emergency Operations Centre. Um, to, to the firefighters, I mean, oh, they were so fantastic, and the, the police and the defence forces, to St John and Red Cross and everyone who came together. And look, an amazing thank you, I just want to say, to everyone who was evacuated. Um, you were so cooperative. Many of you had to leave your homes within moments, and you were just so humble and grateful for all of the help that you received. Um, what an amazing community we live in, and I just want to say an enormous big thank you to Mayor Richard, um, for his support, for his community and to all of us working together. Um, nā mihi nui, uh, kia koutou katoa. So this fire it involved hundreds and hundreds of people and without those uh, people involved in that fire we wouldn't have been able to have the positive result that we got. 
and you know, no people lost and minimal loss of, uh, of property compared with what was possible. And we've got the, a lot of people to thank for that. We've got our volunteers that responded on the day and through the following month. We've got all the people from the multi agencies uh, who, who came on board and, and, and uh, joined the struggle. And we've also got the people of the community who responded to the requests that were made, got on with the job, um, provided what help they could when they could. Uh, and and uh, you know, I'd just like to say a big thank you to the whole region who went well above and beyond the call during this month of those fires.